Hello, District 5960 Rotarians. Here we are with the March edition of Around the District. This is Patricia McLeese, your District Governor nominee designate. Joining me today are Ed Merrick, your District Governor, Kenny Kluster, your District Governor elect, Dale Quigley, your District Governor nominee, and special guest, Al Drazil who serves on the ethics team. Al, what do you have to share with us? Thanks, Patricia. Your district ethics team has a special invitation for you, the members of Rotary. Rotary has a unique ethical decision-making tool called the four-way test. We are asking you to think of how you have used the four-way test or how you have seen it used. Then record a one to three minute video or write a personal story. To make it a little fun, the first 10 submitters in March will receive a Visa gift card. Random prize drawings will continue each month thereafter. So go to rotary5960.org and look on the homepage for some more information. We are looking forward to hearing or reading your stories. Ed? Thanks, Al. March is Water Sanitation and Hygiene Month for Rotary. March 22nd is World Water Day, which is an annual United Nations observance focusing on the importance of fresh water. World Water Day celebrates water and raises awareness of the 2.2 billion people living without access to safe water. This year's theme is valuing water. How we value water determines how water is managed and shared. The value of water is about much more than its price. Water has enormous and complex value for our households, culture, health, education, economics, and the integrity of our natural environment. For more information, click on the link to download the World Water Day Toolkit. Dale? Thanks, Ed. Most Rotarians are aware how the Rotary Foundation works to build peace throughout the world with local and global grants. But how many of you are aware that they also work towards peace by handing out peace scholarships? That's right, the Rotary Foundation offers 100 individuals Rotary World Peace Scholarships every year. The Rotary World Peace Scholarship offers over 100 individuals committed to peace and conflict resolution the opportunity to earn a two-year master's level degree in international studies, peace studies, and conflict resolution at one of the Rotary Center University partners. Rotary is con interacted with six institutions worldwide to provide this valuable training. The deadline for applications to get to local clubs is this April 26 period. That allows the district to get it into Rotary International by July 1st. If you're interested, or I should say somebody in your community, because Rotarians and descendants of Rotarians are not eligible for this. So if somebody in your community has a passion for peace and is looking to further their education, then please have them go to the District 5960 website and look for peace scholarships listed underneath the foundation. That would be www.rotary5960.org slash page slash peace fellowship. Well, Dale, the Arden Hills Shoreview and New Brighton Moundsview Rotary Clubs are teaming up to present their first community forum. And Human Trafficking will feature a panel with speakers from Anti-Child Trafficking United, Terebinth Refuge, and from the Washington County Sex Trafficking Unit. Moderated by Angela Davis, host of Minnesota Public Radio News, mark your calendars for Thursday, April 15th from 7 to 8.30 p.m. and click on the link below to register for this important forum. Patricia? Thanks, Kenny. Also thanks to our guest speaker, Al Drazil, and to all of you for joining us this month. If you have a special event coming up in your club, drop us a line at dg at 5960.link and let us help you get the word out around the district. Celebrate World Water Day on March 22nd, and we will see you in April.